Musk is an international superstar with 23 number one singles and over 58 million albums sold. Welcome back to the show, the two most beautiful words in the English language, Enrique Iglesias. <laughs> They don't, they don't. I don't know what you guys, what do you give your audience? <laughs> it, how come, and it's always girls in the front row. <laughs> not, not a lot of clothing. <laughs> there is a, do, 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 do Latinas wear You guys are George Lopez groupies. No, they're, 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 here, they're not here for me, they're here for Iglesias. They're for, for church. Let as an international superstar, do do women, do Latinas wear less clothes than other women around the world? You know, a lot of people ask me that. Um, do you think you do? do you no, think I, I think I think what us Latin people tend to do is we try to fit into clothing sometimes that's maybe a little bit of one size smaller. Okay. We do. You see my tight jeans? <laughs> No, but I, I don't think, I don't think, uh, a lot of people ask me that. Uh, do you think Latin people are sexier? Do you think we dress sexier? Um, I, I mean, for my... Uh, but I also think that they're I not... I think they're, you're sexy. They're not... Thank, I am sexy, thank you. I, I think you're sexy. I'm thinner. So, but also... But I see. But also, if they're 20 pounds overweight, they make it work for them. They're not afraid to show nalga. You know, other ladies, other ladies get a sweater, they wrap it around their waist so that you don't see their butt. Why are you telling? We could give an example right here. Let's give an example. Go, let's Come give the... an example. Look at it, go, 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 go. No, in Latina? What? There, Enrique, what do you think? Uh, Possible? Wait, but you don't even know. Are, are but you... don't let the blonde hair fool you, she's Latina. <laughs> okay, all right, don't fall. She almost fell off her shoes. Okay. Was she Latina? Are you Latin? You speak Spanish? I'm Spanish and Brazilian. Oh, okay. She's Latina. That's bull. <laughs> All right, so, so, anyways, so you 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 agree that we're we're less frumpy? Um, I, I just think uh, we have a tendency to to express ourselves ourselves a little. Let me more, ask you this: you know? What's the highest weight that you've ever weighed? Because you're uh, the most. Uh, but you see, you. You're talking to like, look, I got chicken legs. I'm a skinny dude. You're talking to, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm probably not the best example. Um, the most I've ever weighed was 245. Get the hell out of here. I did. I How did. did that happen? I used to take steroids back in the day. Oh, you... Yeah. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so two, I can't believe that. So I got some old clothes that, that you know, they'll fit you if you ever go back up. Now, tonight, you performed. I'm talking so much. Tonight, I don't know you, know, you, you know what happens? You have a bar. In the back, está, which is not a good thing. Tomando? No, está tomando ron. Ah, all right. Baby, I like it. Woo! Now, congratulate. He was on American Idol tonight performing uh, D Dirty Dancer. Dirty Dancer. With, uh, our show was in the screen. Congratulations. Yeah, that's nice. It's amazing, right? We were doing the Idol, and right now I'm here. Right yeah, now. you're doing Idol, and then you're here. Now, 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 uh, uh, I, I've... Seen your videos. Are you are you a dirty dancer per se? Do you? You know what? I got two left feet. I'm not even a dancer. I don't even know why, why I wrote a song called <laughs> Dirty Dancer because I mean absolutely. Are you I telling am, me that Enrique Iglesias can't dance? I'm telling you that Enrique Iglesias is probably. If I was asked to be in Dancing with Stars, I would. I wouldn't even make the tryout. Whatever the hell they do. I don't know if they do like. Do a you tryout. believe that? I don't believe it. Do you don't believe even that? make me dance because don't do that. Jorge. Okay. But you know what? It makes sense because in all your videos, you always have viejas all over you and you're sitting down getting kissed. He's never, he's never, he's never up. He never does that. He's always, you know. 
know that. That's because I can't dance. So I just, I tell the director, you know, just let me sit, let the girls dance around me, and that's all I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna sit. Sister, I love it. Now let me ask you that. How, how, you keep on saying sucio, sucio. How, how would, I, you know what it means? How would, how What would, does it mean? It means, like, co cochino, sucio. Cochino. <laughs> you want her to teach you Spanish? I don't think so. Now. How would you do, listen, as yourself as a teenager, because all the American Idol contestants are very young, how, how would you do if you were a teenager on American Idol? Would you be nervous? Horrible. I would be uh, extremely nervous. I don't know how they do it. These kids, uh, they deserve a lot of credit. I, 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 it, it's, think about it. It's the biggest show in the, well, I don't want to say it's the biggest show in the U.S. because... No, it's a big show, in, it's a big show all over show. the world. This is the second biggest show yeah, in the U.S., right? second. Close, close first. Second. <laughs> but imagine... 25 million people are watching you every single day. You're 16, you're 17. I don't know what the, I think uh, 15 is the youngest you yeah. can be. And, and you're in front of all these people and you gotta perform every single night and you gotta do songs that probably you don't feel comfortable with. Right. Songs that you didn't, you know, everybody has their way of singing. So it, it's extremely difficult. It is difficult for them, yeah. Do, do you remember what your first demo and how that happened? I did. Uh, my first demo, I, I borrowed uh, 18, uh, $1,800 from my nanny to do it in Miami. And it was two songs. It was called, one, uh, one in Spanish, one in English. La, the first one was called Si Tu Te Vas, which ended up might be my first single. Yeah, remember that, Si Tu Te Vas? Yeah. And I, I wrote that song when I was like 15, which is crazy. And another one was called, in Engl the other one was in English, was called Only One Night, which is <laughs> I mean, they're both, they're both. So, so your nanny, how did that, how did that come about? Your nanny you see, gave you $1,800. Okay, my parents uh, got divorced when I was uh, three years old. Then uh, I lived in Spain. I, I, was, uh, I moved to America, to the U.S., to Miami, when I was eight years old. And, you know, my dad traveled all the time. Right. Uh, he toured a lot. And my mom lived in Spain with my sisters. So she knew what I was doing. It was, I, I just couldn't hide it. So when it came time for me to do a demo, I was 16, 17. I didn't have $1,800. $1, so I, I asked her for some money, and she, she was nice enough to give it to me. Wow, that's amazing. That's a great story. And you're still in contact with her? Uh, yeah, now she took care of me for the first 25 years of my life. Now I take care of her. I love it. Last time, last time we were here, we played ping pong. I didn't realize you were so good. I lost a bet. Where is and, Sherman? And I'll show you what I had to do when we come back. I'll show you more, more with him. Let me get Now, last time you we were here, we played ping pong, and you're almost like an expert, right? You've I'm played... not an expert. You said you could beat me. Oh, I, well, I didn't, and then we made a, a, a bet to go on a mandate in West Hollywood. And you know what? You didn't see it, but I did go. I know. You, you know what? That says a lot about you. You're, you're, I'm you're a man, man of my word. You are. I'm and, a man and, of my word. And here's what happened. Look right there in the beginning. Uh, you won me in the bet. I know. I was rooting for the other guy, but good constellation. <laughs> Actually, we try. I threw the game. I know so you did. We could hang out. You wanted some chocolate. All right, take it easy. <laughs> That's a pretty good drink. Mm. Is it big enough for you? <laughs> so how's your day going? Oh, it's going good. You ain't getting any, but it's going good. <laughs> good You're a good sport. Are you sad you didn't get on the one today? I am sad because Sherman's my type. Right. Okay. <laughs> no, no. I thought I was your type. The last time you were here, you gave me a kiss, man. Come on. Now, today you spent the whole day, the whole day, about, with, with a special announcement about what's happening in your career. I'm not washing my face. I am, I am. I'm, no, I'm not. I'm not washing my lips. Uh, I am. I'm going to actually tour the U.S. and Canada with Prince Royce and with Pitbull. And, How about and that? Today, uh, you know what? You want to meet Prince Royce? I do. He's We've been here. trying to get him on the show. Is he here? He's here. He's here. He's Let's here. bring him out. Hey, so, so are you excited about the tour? Yeah, man, I mean, um, it's a very exciting tour. Enrique, Pitbull, I mean, um, being part of the tour is just an honor for me, and we're going to have a lot of fun. You know, Pitbull's a crazy one. I, uh, I'm in the middle, uh, and he's... No, wait, wait up, it's the other way around. No, 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 Prince Royce is a crazy one. Pitbull is a conservative one. He's the calm one. I'm in the middle. 
No, wow. I, I don't believe that. No, no. I think you're crazier than you appear to be. I think this is all a front. Get out my look. No, no, when it gets dark, you're the biggest wolf of all of them. El señor Jorge, he seems, he seems. El niño, cuidado con el niño. You got to take care of this young man. These guys, man. You're coming back and you, and you're coming back and you're doing the show, right? Of course, why not? All right. The Dirty Dancer is available now, and tickets for the Euphoria tour go on sale May 20th. Go to LopezTonight.com for a chance to win tickets. Prince Royce and Enrique Iglesias. We'll be right back.